Hey everybody, it's Darren from the Deep Cave Podcast. Time for another episode of Deep Cave Plays, and I got my Captain America t-shirt. I've got my Captain America mouse pad. I'm a Captain America guy. I'm on Team Cap all the way. I know that uh, I've got some friends who are Team Iron Man after the Civil War movie, and I'd just like to say, hope you enjoy throwing away your freedoms. But anyway, I've been thinking about the old Avengers game from the uh, PS4 and the Xbox series, whatever, Xbox One, whatever, and PC. And how everyone's like, man, if only we could have a good Iron Man, Captain America, a good Avengers game. I'm like, we've had a couple. So I figured this would be a good chance to, I don't know, kind of show you a few Avengers Marvel-centric titles over the, over the course of the next few days. Don't mind me, I'm just getting a stopwatch ready because, good lord, uh, the Donkey Kong Jr. video last week was nine minutes long. It was eight minutes too long. God, that game. That game messed with me in so many ways. So, in order to keep myself honest, I'm going to have a timer set up so I know just how long I've put up with the game before I decide I don't want to do this anymore. So today, we are, uh, we've got the Raspberry fired up, so I've got my SN30 Pro from 8-Bit Dough, which they make great 8-Bit Do, 8-Bit Dough, these guys. They make great controllers, really, they do. I've got a wireless uh, Super Nintendo-styled one for my Switch, and I love it, but uh, we've got it out because today we are going to be playing Captain America and the Avengers on the Nintendo Entertainment System. I did a series of videos based on Superman games. So I figure let's do a series based on Captain America and the Avengers and see if someone did a better... Oh, so this is already... We're off to a great start here. I bet I am. Mm-hmm. Well, right off the bat, let's take out the two Avengers everyone cares about <laughs> besides Captain America. Who are you? Oh, that's Wasp. Okay. Okay. Yep. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay. Crystals, got it. Thanks, Wasp. America. Okay, so... America, yeah! Actually, you know, graphically it doesn't look too bad. Get me some points here. Does that just keep happening? You just keep getting the points? Yes. I like the pause music. Finally out, okay. Shield fills substantive. Uh, nice. I can't throw the shield up, but okay. Yeah, that's what you get, buddy. That's what you get for messing with America. I wonder, can the shield just deflect bullets? I mean, it's the shield, right? Yes! <laughs> that's great. Okay, so, so far they got it right. Controls are solid. What in the world? Sweet. I got what I need. I mean, it's not perfect, but, you know, so far this is a decent... Oh, we got moving platforms. All right, let's see how well... Nope. Okay. At least I don't die when I get in the water, otherwise it wouldn't be a very good Captain America, would I? Okay. 
Oh, you cheeky jerk. Okay. First level. Not bad. I forgot to start my timer, so that one was free. If you clear the city stage where Hawkeye is, you'll get to switch places with him. All right. Roger, Wasp. I'm just going to keep being Captain America, though. Okay. Well, I guess we're switching places anyway. I've lived near the Mississippi River almost all my life. That water is way too clean to be the Mississippi River. Okay, so no trick arrows, it seems, from Hawkeye. Not yet. Get the heart, get the heart, yes. But he can shoot up something Captain America cannot do. So already... Oh, he needn't shoot diagonally. Oh, shoot. Hawkeye's the best now. His attack is weaker than Cap's, obviously. Because, you know, arrows don't do as much damage as a shield? Whatever. I seem to be getting more healing items as Hawkeye. Maybe the game just thinks Hawkeye needs the help? But, you know, so far, so good. It's a fairly decent, you know, platformer. It's nothing to write home about. But it's pretty good for what it is so far. Look at that. Y yeah, okay, I figured Wasp. Hey, Wasp, why aren't you helping? Roger, Wasp. Okay, now it's Cap's turn. Hmm. Okay, uh, I guess we'll go to Montgomery, Alabama. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's pitch black in here. That's convenient. Huh. Well, let's see what's in here. Look at that. Found them, and I didn't even know I was looking for them. Haha. <laughs> Don't get the lighting choice in this uh, level, though. But I got what I need, so I just gotta get out of here. Oh. I mean, you can't... You can't hit that while kneeling? There we go! It's weird that it only drops, like, three things at, at a time. I assume those are points. I don't know where the exit is. Whatever. Music's like, oh, look at him dangle. 
music's okay. Like I said, you know, I, uh... I played this game a couple times back when I was a kid, but I haven't really played it since. Gotta say, I'm, uh... I'm liking what I'm seeing so far. It's not too difficult. It seems to, uh... recognize that it should be fun. I love just the subtleties of, like, the shield actually working. Oh, I don't like that. So apparently that's acid, I guess, or something. Well, they're really giving me a whole bunch of healing items this time. Oh, no. There we go. Had to cheese it. Hit the left or right direction key twice to make a running tag. Oh. Okay. Roger Wasp. Well. Guess I'll keep going this way. Yep. There it is. Running tackle. Tell you, it's not, uh... It's a little basic. Oh, just came out of nowhere. It's a little basic, I'll give it that. Um, I figured by now I'd be dealing with the Mandarin, or, uh... You know, that's who took out Iron Man and Vision. Or a boss, at this point. But as far as Marvel games on the NES, this is not bad. I played some stinkers. And for an NES game, it looks uh, fairly good. find a crystal or something. Not those little gems, like a big one. Probably in there. That, that brief pause where uh, there's like a, a second of silence and like boss fight? No. weird for an NES game to load. Oh, I don't think I can reach that. Tackle does nothing. It looks cool. Cap will avoid water and spikes by pressing the down key. Oh. What? Well, I guess one of us is going to have to go into the spikes. So it's going to be me. Red alert. Here we go. What the hell? What am I... God, what, what in the seizure am I looking at here? Holy crap. Get, get down here with your predator-looking ass. No! Okay. Fine. I guess it's 
Hawkeye now. That was crazy. Man, it takes five shots to take care of that guy. And of course, there's another one. Oh, crap. And they keep coming. Will you stop jumping? Oh, my God. Okay. All right. So what happened there was uh, the game realized I was starting to enjoy it. I have to play through the levels again. Okay. No problem. We'll play through these levels again. I like these levels. It's not a problem. No problem at all. Why was he right there and not taking any damage? Never mind. Nope. I like the game. Okay, so the down and B thing does in does in fact work, but it's useless. Okay. Getting pretty rattled here. Just go back. Ha ha ha, I was ready for you. Okay. We'll just go back. Yeah, I know the enemy has captured Hawkeye. I know. Okay. We're doing this crap again. going. We'll go down here and we'll turn on the lights. Holy jumping! I know the enemy has Wasp. I mean, Hawkeye. I guess if I go there, maybe I can save him? I should have read her message. I really should have. Okay, so the vibranium shield does not work on missiles. 
which is fine. It's fine. Did that rescue Hawkeye? Is that what that did? platforms. Yeah, I, I know that. A lot of work for just a tiny gem. I mean, I guess it made sense that Cap would be stronger than Hawkeye. Oh, here we go. Here's the bull crap. I don't know how to not get hit here. So I guess just survive. I guess some of the henchmen here graduated from the Ninja Gaiden School of Bullshit. Sorry for the language, it's just... Come on. Oh, I'm hitting that. What? Nope. Cool, whatever. You gonna show up or not? Oh, you dork. to be Polaris? So that's Captain America and the Avengers on the NES. <laughs> wow. Here I was complaining about no boss fight. And, uh... That's what, that's what you get. You definitely get a boss fight. And, uh, the first boss. That's where kind of... Because I noticed that the controls were a little bit slow, and I'm not making any excuses, okay? It's an NES game that I haven't played in God knows how long. I still say that it's probably a decent game. Just, uh, I'm not in the mood to keep dying over and over. So, 
Next week, we'll probably try a different game, maybe a different Avengers game even, if I can get my hands on it. But yeah, that's Captain America and the Avengers on the Nintendo Entertainment System. It's fine. I mean, honestly, the controls, uh, Cap does move a little slowly, but for what you get, it's fine. So, thanks a lot for hanging out. We'll see you next week with another edition of Geek Cave Plays. And remember, everyone's a geek for something.